What's going on, everybody? It's Matthew A. Rodriguez from the Mars Mindset. You know, we're back in 2023. We're bringing in that poetic justice. I'm going to start it off with, we got to cancel Andrew Tate. We got to cancel Tateism. Many of you would be saying, why would I want to do that? The guy's probably just saying this for attention. The reality is, I think that we should start a new year without being brainwashed. I think the latest allegations against him, not necessarily a sign of good or bad coming from him. What I see is people blindly following somebody that says generalized truths. And sometimes many things I can say that I agree with. Problem is when you get indicted or arrested in a foreign country, I have a father who is a CIA agent. People tend to forget about this and obviously overlook one of the most important factors in this guy's upbringing that separates him from 99% of the population. And anytime you're encountering individuals like this, you need to think about who you're actually listening to and what their background is. But in today's social media world where personas and characters get developed through five to eight second clips, and if you're able to stay on a certain trend and continue to buck heads with the establishment through polarization, you can create an extremely big following. And in my opinion, this is exactly what Andrew Tate did. Now, I'm not saying that's good or bad. What I'm saying is we need to think about who he is. Most of us don't have a family member, friend, or acquaintance who is a member of a government intelligence agency. You think this would have any effect on how he grew up and how he was raised versus the average North American, Canadian American citizen? This is the most obvious thing that comes to my mind and foreign funds. He could easily be speaking to his fan base already knowing that he has arrests and what could be upcoming in his future regarding being involved in shady deals. And that kind of money, that kind of lifestyle does not come from nothing. Personally think getting involved in anything female versus male is a complete error. A lot of people are creating entire careers fueling this agenda of men versus women. Realizing that any societal changes that we do see aren't pre-planned and were put into effect to be affected years ahead of time before we see the actual outcome of what we live in today. We have Andrew Tate's most recent call back to religion. And I just think that the entire program is a program. And if you don't realize that he's programming you, you know, you're lost and you're really caught up in a matrix. I don't want to spend too much time on Mr. Tate but I think if you're following me, you gotta be a little more objective and we need to start 2023 with a brighter mind, not following these people that get arrested. Even Drake was, you know, arrested in another country for God knows Kanye guy missing, Theophilus London. We can't trust any of these individuals nor the information we have provided about these people because they are presented to us. We need to look at ourselves as the number one source of knowledge and truth not look at these outward representations that are presented to us to lead us down a path and most of these people know the talking points they are given the talking points donald trump was given the talking point in the 2016 election do you not think that they have the information and technology available to know who to talk to and what to say to those people it's out there and I am clearly one of the people that doubt the legitimacy of a lot of these individuals that are presented to us. But I think for the younger people and the more impressionable people, these people need to know that Andrew Tate is 100% a scam. He's just trying to make money off you guys. And that's it. That's all it is. His brother stays quiet because he knows his brother runs their in on it together doing all the hand signs and symbolism and the dad CIA. That's all you need to know. There's nothing really else to it besides that. If you like this video, like, share, subscribe, and I'm wishing you a great, prosperous, powerful, and peaceful 2023 spiritual number, number 7777 over you and yours. And yeah, that's it. Cancel Andrew Tate 2023. That's the move.